Area Transit says ridership is down tonight, but it is stepping up to protect people who still rely on buses and other public transit. News News Kelly Antonacci explains in this report for your safety. Chatham Area Transit says these buses are half as packed nowadays. So board members at a virtual meeting voted to make emergency changes. First, Kat says it is suspending all fares very soon. People can enter through the rear doors um, and they can get to their seats faster. Um, plus, they won't have to pass by um, the operator, you know, sitting at the front of the bus near that fear box. The decision will cost Cat more than $71,000 per week, but Cat says fares make up just 3% of their budget. Our interim CEO has assured all of us that we are going to be able to avoid layoffs and we will do our absolute best to make sure that our employees get paid. Board members also voted to reduce service levels. They're working out the details right now, but CAT's chief strategy officer says weekday service will probably look like services on the weekend. And she says a 50% drop in ridership will allow them to do this. Kat says federal agencies may reimburse them for buying extra disinfectants for its employees. Employees are cleaning buses and facilities every night. In addition to wiping down some of those common handled materials or places on the bus that you can kind of spray the bus you know, leave it overnight and that also helps. Emergency measures will stay in place until the end of April when board members talk again during a regularly scheduled meeting. Kelly Antonacci, WSAV News 3, on your side. When Chatham Area Transit implements its emergency schedule, you can call customer service with questions. That number is 912-233-5767.